All right, and welcome to another stream. This is going to be a, a new idea that I haven't done myself, and hopefully you guys enjoy it. We are going to be running this brand new S331 Ford pickup in the uh, tow truck variation. I'm not familiar. I'm guessing that's a, an overseas design, but uh, based on a normal Ford platform. So we'll go ahead and switch this over. Uh, it's been fun putting this skin together. I actually was working on it last night and decided to go ahead and put it into an actual um, into an actual stream by itself instead of just having it around because we're going to introduce two vehicles. Uh, first off is the Ford S331. Let's go ahead and turn this around here. This is a truck that is available. It's non-ELS, but it's available on lspdfr.com. And the skin I created for it custom. Which I'm having a lot of fun with it here. You've got 1-800-OUT-OF-LUCK. Uh, <laughs> An easy number to remember. Uh, Calander Towing Service and uh, Roadside Peace of Mind. So there we go. Pretty cool looking truck though. I'm really having fun with it. It's the first non-ELS vehicle I've put in a game in quite a while. Uh, let me just double check something, make sure this is running alright. Looks like uh, YouTube is saying that we're running into a little bit of an issue. Just let me know if you can't see what's going on. But uh, in the meantime, yeah, so this is how the truck turned out. I'm really happy with it. I, the skin may evolve as time goes on, but, you know, I'm pretty happy with how it looks so far. You can customize the license plates in the window and on the back. And the interior is not bad either. Let's go ahead and just uh, warp our way through the, w the door here. So there's the interior. Not bad looking. Got a couple screens there. One for work on the top, one for fun on the bottom. It's based off of a Saline uh, F-150, so good quality truck there. It is an automatic, unfortunately, but I guess if you're working with a tow truck, that's not so bad. We are prepared with a fire extinguisher, extinguisher if necessary. And this over here is Robert. This is going to be his first... Oh, I mean, he's been driving tow truck for a long time. But this is the first time he's gotten a contract with the city of Los Santos. As you can tell, he's excited. This is pretty much his excited face. Yeah, it's about the best I'm going to get. But we're just going to drive around see what we can help out with the city. I'm still getting low quality. That's really weird to me. Let me close down a few extra windows here. Maybe that'll help. Close out the music. Close that out. We'll just see if that picks itself up, because I, I don't want it to be a poor quality stream the whole time. It's supposed to be going out in 720. But, uh, yeah. Let's go ahead and hop in this truck real quick. Take a look at, take a look at the lighting. This is, like I said, non-ELS. But the brightness is great. I mean, honestly, if I were to look at that, I wouldn't know that it wasn't ELS. So I'm pretty happy with that. It's got a horrible sounding sound. Or, uh, so, uh, not sound, but uh, horn. But the cool thing with non-ELS is that that means I get my... Uh, Oh, I, you know, it's been so long since I've used it, I can't remember what it's called, but basically the cinematic view. There we go. I knew I'd get it eventually. So there we go. That is not what I wanted to do. That is our new truck, so that's pretty cool. I'm pretty excited about that. Of course, every time you get on the road like this, it's always late night and raining when it's your first shift, so seems appropriate. Looks like it is an early morning, though. Uh, let's go ahead and bring in the other truck. The other one does need a little more work, and I don't think there's much more I can do with it myself. Hey, Rai, welcome to the stream. Thanks for stopping by something that's a little bit unique for my channel. I've never done a tow truck stream, so we'll see how it goes. Uh, so this, and yeah, definitely, I'll go ahead and do another lap around the truck here so you can see it. This is the S331, which is based off of the Saline F-150, and a skin that I put together for it over the night. And I'm pretty happy with the result. I love the uh, the phone number for him. 1-800-OUT-OF-LUCK. It started out as something really professional sounding, like something that AAA has, but 
there we go. I like this one better. Uh, the other truck is going to be a flatbed. Let's get that spawned in here, game. There we go. So this is a much larger F550. But this one is ELS with the uh, warning board on the top. So pretty cool looking truck here. Let's go ahead and kind of... Oh, whoops, I turned off my reshade. How did I do that? No. Nope, that wasn't it either. Oh, that doesn't... No, I don't like that. I got rid of reshade and that's not what I wanted to do. Let me take a quick look here and see if I can bring that back. Um, da, 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 da. Play some music while I'm working on that. No, that doesn't want to work either. <laughs> Just when you think you've got it all set and ready to go. There we go. Play a little music here. It'll be just a moment, though. Um, can't believe I did that. Definitely didn't mean on mean to do that. If you guys happen to know that command, I'd be happy to go ahead and just use that too. Hmm. It sucks when it's just a matter of pushing the wrong button when you're not looking at the screen and there we go. That's all it is. So, in case I forget next time, it's pause break. Makes the game look a whole lot different, though. Brightens it up a bit. Okay. So, let's go ahead and take a look at this F550. We've got stage one with just the reader board on top. Go ahead and kill the music there. So, just the reader board on top. Then we have stage two. You got just the lights with the reader board there. And then if you want it to be a little more exciting, you turn on uh, stage three and the lights go crazy. That's where you really want to be seen. And we'll take a look at the inside of this vehicle as well. Let's go ahead and join Robert here in the truck with all of his tattoos. Hands are on the wheel. The buttons are pretty realistic looking. And I have a Ford vehicle and some of these look spot on. I don't have a truck, but this is pretty nice. All right, so what we will do during this uh, first shift on duty here is we're going to turn on the LSPD scanner. We won't be able to re actually, we're not going to take any calls because we're not law enforcement. If it's a tow call, though, or they need a tow truck, we'll go ahead and back them up. So let's go ahead and get this started, though. Uh, this one does need a little more work. Uh, when you get out of the vehicle, in and out of the vehicle, it just kind of pops in and out. And of course you have to go into the commands to actually attach a vehicle to the bed. So we'll let uh, our buddies drive that one for the day. And then if they get a call where there's all four flat tires, the vehicle's destroyed, uh, that flatbed will come in and pick it up. Otherwise, we'll take care of it. Whoa, there's a, a boat there. Alright, well let's go ahead and turn our lights off here and just kind of cruise around. And turn on our scanner so we can hear what's going on. I hope you guys are having a great day, though. Today is some part of the day. I'm pretty sure it's actually Monday, isn't it? Yep. Monday here, almost mid, or almost noon. <laughs> Thanks, Ry. Yeah, the skins, I, I made the skin for both. Try to make them matchups. It's going to be the new towing service for Ella, or Los Santos one of these days. Once we've built up a reputation of helping law enforcement with their calls at a timely manner without getting in their way and not getting shot at every time we tow a vehicle. You know, every time the uh, local company does it, they uh, end up losing drivers, so we're going to go for a much better track record than that. And it's early morning, cruising around here. Robert's just enjoying the scenery. See if we can find some illegally parked vehicles, or, you know, if 
uh, LSPD has a... Uh, there we go, actually. Let's see if they have any shootouts or anything they need us to remove a vehicle for them. Once this uh, drunk lady stag staggers across the road, we'll pull over here, because this isn't a fire lane. There's no reason you had to park here. It's right in front of no parking. Uh, let's go ahead and call in our dispatch to contact uh, LSPD's dispatch and see if we can get a plate check on this. Let them determine if there's anything that needs to be done with this vehicle before we touch it. Target vehicle. Four, three, Frank, Mary, three, nine, six, a traffic violation, a traffic felony. Proceed with caution. Okay, so this vehicle's got all sorts of issues. Let's go ahead and just check the inside here real quick. Doesn't look like they've left any belongings inside, except for all their cigarettes and their phone mount. All right. Well, no problem. We've informed our dispatch of what we found. Uh, according to LSPD, they just want the vehicle removed. They don't need it left here for any reason. So we will go ahead and assist them in doing so. Get rid of that map. There we go. Attention unit one, Lincoln 18. There we go. We are attached. We we'll lift it up here just enough to get it off the ground. A little tug test there, make sure it's attached. Let's go ahead and hop back out and make sure everything looks good. Robert, Robert's a professional. He knows what he's doing. Fortunately, it means I don't have to actually know a whole lot about it. <laughs> so he's just going to take a look there. And while he does... We'll just take another look around the truck here. Yeah, overall, this is pretty fun. I've, I've never done anything quite like this. I know it's it's not drawing a lot of attention there in the chat, but that's all right. Let's go ahead and get this vehicle out of here. And let's take a quick look at our map to make sure we drive it back to the right place. Which is going to be... Not that one. We've got a little ways to go. We're actually going to take it up to the impound lot. I want to say is this one? Uh, I could be wrong, but we're going to try it. Worst case scenario, we might recognize places as we go. Alright, so dispatch, we are headed back with one vehicle. It's going to be a teal colored rancho type vehicle. Ranchero type vehicle, there we go. Alright, hey, Jamie, welcome to the stream. Not only is Roy Wilson is in the house, but Jamie is as well. Thank you for being here. Hope you're having a great day. Got something a little different today. Waiting for traffic to clear. We're just going to hop the curb there in the middle. Take a left. Well, we're going to do something illegal twice. Let's just get going. Keep finding ourselves going the wrong direction. There we go. Now we can be a little more legit. Alright. So to hear that sad horn... Not sure. I guess that's one of the costs we had to cut in order to get this truck fully decaled and set up. Just an awful rainy day. I guess that's what we get for it being our first shift. <laughs> we'll take whatever we can get. We have a report of a criminal activity. A hold up in Davis. Alright, that is an ELS command. That's what I thought. I was going to try to use the turn signals there. Alright, well, you guys have any... Uh, crazy plans for the week. Hopefully something more than just work and I guess school's out for most people, so hopefully there's some plans for the summer. Oh, there's a police car there. I'm not going to run it. That's not... i got to stop doing that when I'm not moving. <laughs> Truck wants to go.
Just work? Yeah, that's what I'm looking at. I mean, I've got the house stuff going on, but nothing is really moving on that for right at the moment. I don't care about that. There we go. It's gonna be tough not wanting to react to people doing stupid stuff on the roads. Like what I'm about to do here. Let's just run this light. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, coming through. Citizens report a uh, possible 148 on um, last port death freeway. Hmm. So I'm looking for the, the place that we usually start out. What am I. Is it actually. The, it's not this one, I don't think. I'm looking for the station that has that's right next to Franklin's house that has the like the Davis Sheriff's office that's in town. Is it this one up here? Can't really tell by the marks. Actually, I guess it should tell me. No, it doesn't. Okay. Well, if you guys know, just let me know. Awesome, Officer Terry, thanks for stopping by and thank you for subscribing to Rye Wilson. I know if you enjoy any of this kind of content, he does some awesome stuff. Law enforcement, uh, any other variety of that. Uh, GTA, LSPDFR, related stuff. Rye's got some of the funniest stuff going on out there, so definitely check him out. We're going to take this corner really sharp and really fast. Robert's not the most patient to tow truck driver in the streets. Oh, no. It doesn't turn at all. <laughs> Cut back over here, get back on the road there. Robert, what are you doing? Bobby? I guess that's probably what he would actually be called. Um, I wanted to go down that way. Uh, Robert wants to go for it. Well, this is definitely not the area that I was intending to drive to, so I've got the wrong police station. I don't know why I can't envision where this one's at. I know I always go there. <laughs> Well, let's go ahead and go to this one, because at least I know they do have a place I can park it. It is the other direction, but we'll figure it out and get to the right uh, right depot here eventually. I'm going for it. Working in it is so muggy. Oh, that's awful. You just need a day like what's happening here in the game. It's just all rain. I think we're supposed to get up to 80 tomorrow, so it's going to get warm again. It rained over the weekend, but before that we had nice weather pretty much all two, three weeks or so before that. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Places to be. i got to tell more than one vehicle today. Oh no, I almost had a vehicle to tow right there. I'm going to go around this guy. Looks like it's saying to stay off of the highway. Hey, Officer Terry, 81 subs is an awesome achievement. We just actually, I noticed when I started up this stream, we are up to two, 230 subscribers here, which is awesome. Back off. You know tow, tow truck drivers are armed, so back off. I'm going to try to get this car back there in one piece. We'll see how it goes. But every, if you don't think of it as subscribers, as just something you have to have, it's so much more fun to enjoy the community growing as you go and that's what I've been doing I've had a, so much fun with it the discord server has been filling up we've had a lot of good conversations there uh, the, a lot more people in this in the ch chat usually and it's just been a lot of fun so I really appreciate you guys being here and I love the fact that we can help other channels grow by subscribing to each other as well I know William has been growing his channel that same way uh, Rye has just skyrocketed in the last year huge number of subscribers all right, Robert is no longer patient. Get out of the way. Attention, all units. We have a I think I just got called in as a drunk person. Um, Street, according to that map. All right, so we are on scene. Let's go ahead and try to... Oh. Yeah, we're going to have to back up. See how this handles that. Not so well. Let's uh, get ourselves looped around here. 
Obviously, this is not American Truck Simulator. The physics are just not quite there. Up into first... Well, first person doesn't do me any good. No! Oh. Who? Thought the game was going to crash there. Gonna keep backing it up. Keep backing it up. Ooh. Oh, hit the post. Roger. We're heading over now. Why did it let did it let go of the car? Nope. Okay, we're good. So that door doesn't actually want to open, so we'll use the one down the ramp there. Citizens report a criminal resisting arrest on uh Elgin Avenue. Don't worry, if I ever do get back into American Truck Simulator, I can back better than this. I'm just really not doing so well in GTA. Come on, open up the door. Hey guys, you want this car? Open up the door. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to lower this. And I don't know how I got across that center console, but we're going to lower the car. There we go. Drop the car. We'll go ahead and back into it. And that should open up the door. Okay, come on, man. We had the keys for it. Leave it to Robert. Break open the car. Alright. Well, dispatch, can you let uh, LSPD know they have one vehicle successfully impounded at their station in the Vespucci Mission Row area? Vespucci Boulevard and Mission Row area. Just off of Center Street. And we will go ahead and clear this area and get back out there, see what we can find. One successfully impounded vehicle. A lot of JJ vehicles out here. Love these cars. Really nice skin that comes with them. I usually swap them out, but didn't feel like that was super necessary there. Robert wants to move. Let's go. We almost went a wrong way and a one way. All right, well, just glad that that officer there was staring at his computer and said, Yeah, I'm working the next uh, next five days, and I've got two 12-hour shifts in a row at the end of the week, which is going to suck. But you know what you have to do. Oh, I just realized I don't have my speedometer on. Attention, all units. Citizens reporting a suspicious vehicle on um. Uh, Boulevard. There it is. Oh, it says it's visible. Oh, it's just white on a white background there. We're good. Yeah, absolutely. What I was saying there is absolutely right. If you keep putting out videos, especially if it's the same content, uh, not the same content, but the same related material, such as gaming, you'll bring in a crowd very quickly. And it's pretty awesome how that happens. Especially if you have a little bit, something a little bit unique. Uh, it definitely attracts some attention. Go ahead and just switch something here. Is it still running really slow for you guys? Because I'm... Unfortunately, YouTube is saying that it is. Because this really should be in uh, at least 720 for the clear picture. I'd love to stream at 1080, but I don't have the internet for that. Cruising downtown here. Well, it looks like they're legally parked. We have a possible 503 on um, Vespucci Boulevard. Man, if that is that quality, I may have to restart the stream or something. Actually, we probably won't go too much longer. Unfortunately, this will be a shorter stream as I do need to leave for work. As it always is. But... Uh, this is something, if you guys enjoy this kind of stuff, because this is the first time I've ever done a tow truck screen, a stream.
first time I've ever done a stream that wasn't law enforcement, I think, when it comes to GTA. Hey, that guy's parked in front of a fire hydrant. Let's go ahead and get looped around here. That is not gonna fly. What are you doing? Back off. Let that guy go by. There we go. We have a 503 on um, Supply Street. Okay, so we're out of the vehicle, so let's not be able to hear our scanner from there, but let's contact our dispatch and get another plate check through LSPD here. Going to be 03 Union Edward Ocean 035. Target vehicle license Oh, that was close. 03 Union Edward Ocean 035, a traffic felony. Proceed with caution. Okay. Well, it's something I should have done on the last one, but... What am I doing? Whoa. I'm going to go ahead and just search it, and actually search it instead of just looking through the windows. And we'll make sure there's nothing in there that LSPD needs to be aware of. A uh, compound bow, glass cutting equipment, an empty bottle of alcohol, spare tire, and a beach towel. Alright, well, nothing too exciting. I'll take that compound bow and hook it up in the back of the truck there. Alright, so there's nothing to really worry about there, but they, the LSPD has indicated they want this vehicle brought in. As it is not registered. Uh, okay, down. There we go, we are attached. Forgot to do the t test first. There we go. Yeah, Bobby's a pro here. He he knows exactly what he's doing. Apparently, that's not he's done nothing else, but that's okay. All right, dispatch. We are back en route to the station. We actually have a station that's really close to us. That does have a garage, an impound lot, so we'll go ahead and take it right over there. Robert wants to go. Wow, he's really driving aggressive. Maybe he should calm down just a tad bit. Okay. Well, what do you guys think? Is this something you guys want to see more of? Because I'm having a lot of fun with it. It's a little slower, and unfortunately, I don't think there's a lot of call-outs. I can't find any call-outs so far for it, but if anyone knows of tow truck call-outs, it is not driving the standard truck for Tanya in the single-player missions. Uh, I'd be happy to hear about it. And if not, well, maybe we'll do that instead. Let's go ahead and change up weather. Maybe it's going to clear up a little bit. What do you think? Maybe. So here's the station. I should have been driving it this way. Yeah, it sounds like I'm driving a U-Haul. Alright, we are at the impound now. Straighten her out. Come on. Come on, Robert. You know how to do this. I think you've literally been doing this all your life. Show us your skill. Well, that's going to have to be good enough. All right, so we'll lower it back down, drop the vehicle, and be clear. All right. Well, what do you guys think? Is this something that might catch your interest in the future? Maybe have a little bit more planned ahead and try some new things? I know LSPDFR is our main focus when it comes to GTA, but I thought it might be fun to branch out. I'll also be able to tell what you guys think with the likes and dislikes. See if we have 
any number of views and likes, as well as anyone sharing it to their friends. I'm, act I'm, I'm still really happy with how this truck turned out. We'll go ahead and do one more uh, pickup here. I'm going to just pull over here to the side. Coming through. You think it's fine? Some people actually really like the tow truck episodes? Okay. Yeah, I don't have a lot of experience with the tow truck episodes. It's probably not my main focus, but I know that there are some uh, very popular streams that involve it. If you guys do enjoy tow truck related stuff, I know uh, what Ace Pilot has done some tow truck stuff as well as uh, excuse me, GM Anton Z. He's got his entire tow truck company. Kind of a similar idea, but completely different designs. And I think trucks as well, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, let's go ahead and bring out the flatbed. See how well it works. The only thing I'm going to have to do is figure out how to attach a vehicle, and I don't have menus, so I might just have to bring this one out first to have the the board out and then have someone drive that truck out to pick it up. That'll work. Hey, whoa, that's on the sidewalk. Hold up. Did, did not take as long to find something. I wish there was a way to raise and lower the bed, like flatten it out, drive the truck up on there. That'd be pretty cool. I have to look into that and see if there's a way to do it. Benzo does it as well? Okay, cool. Not bad. I'm, I'm liking this truck, too. Alright, let's go ahead and have this plate checked. Okay, my dispatch is asleep. There we go. It's going to be a Huntley 67 Lincoln David Young 292. Target license plate. And while they're checking that, we'll go ahead and search it. Not him. Look at that. No insurance on this one either. And this guy has a hatchet on him. Well, you need to go away. I'm not even sure why I searched him. You're drunk. You go away. Alright, some LSD, a ski mask, Proposition 208, bag of groceries, another ski mask, so we got two ski masks and a clown horn, a portable pill press, and a Zippo lighter. Well, we're going to have LSPD very much aware of that, as we will get this vehicle towed out of here, and we'll just have Joe, the uh, veteran of the company, okay, we both we just started this company, but we'll have him come out and pick this up. Oh no, there I just got in the car. Alright, well at least this way, no one's going to run into it. I think our tow truck is actually in... the garage. But that's okay, we've got another one that just came down the street that will go ahead and take the call instead. Oh, it's going to be the other one! I know I told it to change that setting, so I'll have to look into that. I specifically told it when I use LSPDFR to call a tow truck that it would be the uh, other one. That's okay. I think our tow truck got stuck in the garage, and that was a passing truck that was willing to take them. So. Another company got the, the, fa the fee out of that, but at least the vehicle's off the sidewalk. All right, guys, well, that's going to do it for me. Thank you for being here. Really appreciate it. Hope you have a great rest of your week. Here it is Monday, but, you know, what better way to start it than with some uh, LSPDFR, GTA, and Calendar Tow Truck, or Tow Services um, streaming. So thank you guys for being here. Hope you have a great day. And uh, let's go ahead and pop this one back in. Turn the lights on, and that's how we'll finish it out. Let me know if you guys want to see more of it, or maybe you have some other ideas of what we could do for future streams down the road.
Interesting. Now I can't get in that truck. No, 